thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're back in Ranch Simulator. Now, a lot of you were asking what was going on. It takes a long time to do what I just did. All right? I gotta be honest with you. Yeah. That's right. The biggest pile of meat I've ever put together. Even Sally would be kind of sad not to see this, but it is quite large, and I can't even tell you how much frame rates are dropping from being near all these pigs now all the adult pigs are gone i left all the little porkers alive and kicking so they're all good oh. can you can you can you say absolutely stunning it is mammoth i can't i don't know how many pieces that is can you close oh no it's not even that <laughs> look at this look how big this pile is it's stunning isn't it Oh, I worked my absolute buttocks off for this. There's only little baby piggies left in here. There should be only little baby piggies. Uh, man, the frame rates when I was walking here, at one point we're off the wall. All this is going to be more pigs. Oh, God help me. Jesus. Oh, so many pigs. So little time. What should I do? Yeah, that, that is the mammoth pile of all mammoth piles of, of meat I've ever done. Now we got to go and stockpile the living crap out of that. That's right. But to do that, uh, we're going to need a lot of those things. So right now, the pigs are unable to get in here, so this is a good thing. Uh, we have tons of chickens and stuff. We should probably go and check. I think I just checked before. There's a lot of eggs, by the way. There's a freak load of eggs. It took a long time to do. Now, let's go and check one thing before I do all this. We're probably going to need to go and buy ourselves a whole bunch more of these because it's only 12 each. God, can you just stick it in there, please? Do you see how much work I have left of me? Come on, get in the hole. Thank you. Um, these should be all empty too and on top all empty so what we're gonna do is try and fill up as much as we possibly can unfortunately these little porkers are gonna go and expand themselves into bigger porkers once that happens i have to take them down too and really i think we're gonna minimize the amount of pigs we're gonna separate the girls versus boys we're gonna keep this closed and gonna keep it nice and steady for now because holy moly that drove me up the wall up you there's a pig out there the hell happened how did he there's some dead animals there okay all right come here come here what the hell's going on it's gonna take forever to go and pick up a whole bunch of crap do you know that how am i gonna get you back in here oh i can probably do from the side okay you coming come on little one i wish i could just pick you guys up i really do wish all right but yeah that is a mammoth pile and i think that's pretty good i mean we're doing pretty good overall i just hope no babies come out from this store oh wow the frame rates in here are still bad it is it is pretty bad let's add another one to it <clears throat> i just can't get myself to kill the little ones all right uh, yeah a lot of nighttime killing going on here so let's uh let's make this happen as much as i possibly can here uh, we're gonna pick up as many of these pile up oh, oh we can't oh my god and do, you, do you see our frame rates this must be 12 in there i guess right so 12 yes it is <laughs> so much of it i don't even know it doesn't take very long to pick up a whole bunch of these little suckers. I just don't know how much we have in here. So I actually need to pile up a whole lot of these on a trailer. Go myself, buy myself another trailer, I think. Uh, back at the... Oop, I need another one of these. And uh, then fill up that trailer with more of these so you can see how much money we make off these things. And hopefully I'll try and wait for something like a 2 point or at least a 1.8 to 1.9 to 2 times the amount i'd like to know how much money this is worth right now we have tons of cash i've been filling up these things like crazy we did spend and got ourselves a lot of piggies uh sorry a lot of horses last time and we get a good profit on it look at this i'm going to show you guys in a second oh oh i, I screwed this up let me show you the profits we have here on here there's tons of it right now we have sixty-two thousand one hundred seventy-three. we still haven't built our big house which i really want to do I want to get that completed. There's still some building to left to do here. I'm waiting for the updates. I mean, honestly, I don't think the updates have been coming out as fast as this game deserves to have. Uh, we're having a lot of fun with it. I was hoping the devs would have been a little more into it. I'll be able to lie to you. You guys know I'm not going to lie to you. I, I think their their plan of action is uh, a bit... I don't know how to say it nicely. Um, lackluster? <laughs> Unlike the people like the dev, you know, for, I don't know, the infected, which has you know added a whole bunch of stuff i'm not sure if they ran out of ideas or what but there's gonna be uh, some good news out of this there will be some self-milking machines and stuff that can be added to this game again i don't know how long it takes and how many i think they have quite a few, a few people oh there's another dead deer there um a few people working on this game i'm pretty darn sure 
there's a, quite a few people working on this game. Anyway, so it is what it is. Uh, my two cents are going to be thrown out there. Just uh, I think they could have done it a little bit more for you know people who bought it. This game you know, did very well. I, uh, the horses are a good add-on, but I think there could be a whole bunch more to the corrals and stuff and such. You know, it's all good. Let's uh, let's talk positive and back to normal. I just you know, I'd like to throw my two cents out there so often. And but yeah, I still enjoy this game. I think the game is fun. And uh, yeah, I mean it's it's. I still think we deserve to have some. Uh, people working for us like scott and other things that come out here and feed the animals or at least maintain them i know some people want to corral on your side so they can go and take care of the horses and breed them and uh you know get them kind of up and running so we can make some money and we really see this place flourish like crazy a few more buildings would be nice so i think i could go endless amount of things we can go through here my god it's a frig load of meat <laughs> what have i done it takes so long <laughs> this is gonna take forever all right well, we're gonna try our best we'll continue working our butts off but first thing first i need to get myself back out there and uh getting some extra containers and such we gotta go shopping i love shopping let's go and hitch this up um hopefully the frame rates are gonna get better as we progress right now i need to move all this meat inside of here back out of this area as much as possible the <laughs> further that we go the better off we're gonna be from this area oh already i can see our frames coming back all right now a lot of people are saying there's a whole bunch of oh my god been a while I've been, oh here we go we're okay we're, we're, everything's okay i got a solid front of this truck it does not get uh, destroyed in any way shape or form uh there's other deer walking around i can see them right now at this point with the amount of money we have on this it's just sick uh, there's bodies of deer everywhere here i'll need to pick them all up and we're gonna sell them off for sure um, but yeah, first things first, I need to be able to see if I can place this in here with, do you think we're going to be able to do, do so we're going to have to drop one off here and we're going to try and go buy ourselves a bigger trailer. Now the question is, is a bigger trailer going to, oops, is good, the bigger trailer, oh my God, <laughs> the bigger trailer going to be able to fit in here. Am I going to have to take each one of those off? There's so many dead animals in this place. <laughs> I have one trailer ready, but it's my lumber yard trailer. So I need to get myself a new one it's it's full it's it's full 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 so we're gonna take care of that all right um there's bears up here too we gotta be careful for that's gonna take my truck back out here nice and slow try not to ram it again if possible we're gonna back this baby up here we're gonna buy the trailer first and we're gonna get ourselves ready to buying a crap load of stuff very very fast all right let's go over here people ask me this question all the time for paint it's right here by the way you can buy the paint right here you just press e and you can buy about four at a time you don't need to buy a whole lot right and like i did last time i bought way too many so i'm thinking one way or another i'm gonna to have to take down everything out of there right i'm gonna to have to remove everything out of these i won't be able to fit all this i have to stock them up i don't know how it's gonna work i really don't know if i'm gonna be able to sell it all off at once we're gonna try our best get a new trailer check that out Okay, we're okay with that. We're in good shape. <laughs> Big trailer. Okay, and, uh, and then we're going to jump in our truck and just pick that trailer up. I feel like I should go and buy it from Sally, but anyway, Sally owns both stores, I think. That's what it is. Or she works for both. This one she does remotely. <laughs> gonna, we're going to move it forward because we're going to need the space. Yeah, I know. It's going to hit that. Uh, it's fine. Just need to wrap space. Okay. Okay, good. And then we're going to open this baby up here. And then I'm going to do the unforgive. Oh, man, I can't. Why do they give this to you and not give us the opportunity to get this, to use it? Ugh. Just just put out the stuff. I'm ready for it. There's, like, other things in here, too, you know? They're like, animals don't even show up in this one. There's no animals. But there's there's definitely beef and other thing in, at Sally's place. I, I don't know. Are we going to do, like, 40 of them, I think? Let's start off with, okay, 41. Let's do 50. Screw it. Slow it down. This time. No. Okay. We're going to do 50. Check out. <laughs> I don't know what's getting up there. Oh, not bad. Is that really 50? <laughs> I'm going to count them. I'll be back in a few. It's going to take some time. All right. So that's 50. That's that's what 50 looks like. Ah, God damn it. Doesn't look like there's enough. Doesn't look like it's going to be enough. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to go in here and we're just going to hold down the little button here and I'm going to pull out another hundred of these. I don't know if we can actually put a hundred. We're going to find out in a few seconds. Look how much money that is, by the way. It's just, it's just insane. We're going to, we're going to have so many of these things. I don't know if we're going to make our money back on this or not, but 
You gotta do is what you gotta do, is, you know what I'm saying? Actually, we'll make our money back. I'm just uh 99s and max. <laughs> Did I break the game? How much money do I have left, by the way? Just to make sure. 45,000. Okay, well, a bit of a disaster. <laughs> Freak, why do I do this to myself? This is gonna take for freaking ever. All right, yeah, so that means right here, so these are 24 a row, so 24, 24, that's 48, that was 50 across. Uh, so it's good to know how much we could fit on here. Uh, we can stack them up three, which is sweet because we had a problem before. Uh, the smaller trailer can only stack too high. Uh, so yeah, a little bit of a problem, especially when you're trying to uh, carry as many as we're trying here. So we should be able to fill all this. <laughs> God, I just can't believe this. What time is it at one o'clock in the afternoon? In real life, this took me about a good 15 minutes, I think, per uh, for 50 of them. So this should take me another half an hour. Yeah, this is going to take me for freaking ever to do. By the way, holy Jesus, Murphy. Oh my God, get me out of here. Oh no, he hit my truck. Oh no, no, no. Why did he hit my truck? Why did you come down here? Where the hell did you go? Oh, oh, saved by the truck. Oh, yeah, baby. Am I reloaded? I am loaded. Oh, thank goodness. So, uh, yeah. Strong truck, huh? Built tough. Yeah. You nasty little bucker. What the frick? <laughs> Why did he come down here? I never seen him this far down. He must be hungry or something. Maybe chasing a deer and got himself down. Oh man, I'm still reeling from that bear being next to me there. Uh, he moved my, by the way, my my trailer a little bit. So now nothing's gonna be straight exactly the way I want it, but it's okay. I gotta, I gotta take these off anyways and place them back up. So what I'm thinking, I'm gonna buy myself another trailer like this. I'll come back and pick it up overnight. Uh, I'm gonna, after I clear this out, because I don't want the trailer to pop up and be a big problem right now. Uh, I'm gonna snack these up. You can see a little bit crooked to the left there because uh, Sir Bear a lot decided to smack our truck. He's not even supposed to be down here, by the way. I don't know what the hell he is here. I went to look to see if there's a deer around here. There's no deer. Uh, either that, the deer just ran the frig out of here. So it's very possible. Okay. So, um, yeah, this happened. And we did it. It's uh, almost 8 o'clock at night now. It's uh, 7.30, so we're doing uh, pretty good. We got everything done. It took the whole entire day to get this completed. We're just going to go on a computer here. I'm going to buy myself one more of these. And I'm just going to invest in that and check out so when we come back i'll be able to grab this thing up i'll place it next to it so my goal is to grab all these and start making my way on the side of the actual barn and over there i'll park this one inside i'll drop them off that way it's an easy drop and come back and forth i guess you guys understand what i'm talking about it just makes it a lot easier it really will because the last thing i want is to have to place oh my god this is janky as crap right now Holy moly, I can't even see over my... Th there we go. There we go. Okay, I'm, I'm hoping it's still there. Let's just double check it because I've left those behind before. That's okay. There we go. That's a frig load of ghoulers. <laughs> um, somewhere down the line, I lost my load. Right down there, I guess. Got to back this up. hitch I'm not sure what hit why I did that it was all of a sudden it just dropped off thank god I went back out I was in first person I said oh, I better come back out and double check to see if everything's okay and it wasn't so I'm going to try and ride this as close as I can to the fence line here which means I will need to get rid of you holy crap is that really the light okay one second Holy moly, that's super bright. I'm just going to grab these over here for now. These are obviously all full. Keep your eyes open now and too. I'm not sure how the chickens are doing. I haven't checked them all day. I'm going to have to check out the feed too. How we're doing on that. Oh, is there a baby in there? There she is. Okay, get her inside. Sorry for your poops and stuff, everybody. Yeah, go and get some warmth in there. Oh my god, there's more eggs everywhere. And there's there's poop everywhere. Oh my god, I don't have enough time. I need a farm hand. All right, here's a strategy. Let's hope this works here. Let's uh, open this up. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Does it not? Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> oh my god, I was like, oh no, it's not going to work. 
Okay, good. So my strategy is going to be a lot easier now to go up here. I actually had a couple more of these and I didn't realize it. Uh, but yeah, so we'll be able to grab this and just insert it back in top of here inside there. So that way I can just grab from this side and grab and place it there. Very expensive process, but I guess once we have it all, it'll be fantastic. Uh, well, fantastic. Yeah, as fantastic as it could possibly be because I got a crap load of work to do here. I mean, a crap load of work. Plus, and, uh, those are good news or bad news. I'm not sure those pigs are plumping up a tiny bit and uh it would seem that i might have to uh get more dinners <laughs> i don't know how much this is going to cost <laughs> someone's got to do the calculations in the next uh bit here to find out exactly how much we spent versus how much we made i, I, I guess it's well, pretty easy i did it when we finish it all up we'll get to see the amount of money but also i have to feed these little suckers during that time and yesterday night i put 154 dollars so this got to go back to the front of video where i checked exactly how much I started with, and then from there we'll uh, we'll figure out exactly the amount from there. Oh my God, this is so much! I'm a little flustered right now. Uh, you can see that the frame rates they're completely being chewed up. This is definitely a large pile of meat, and I don't know what we're gonna do. These are obviously uh, gonna be some fun times. Now we had an extra four of these, right? So 154 is gonna go on top of this. <laughs> it just look, I'm grabbing, and there's no end to it. <laughs> It feels like it at least. Okay. My guy's getting a little tired. That's not a uh, shadow mark in the back of his jacket. That's sweat. Blood and tears. Now I am feeling a little bad. I'm looking as I'm doing this. There's tons of pigs that come out to go and check their relatives going into a little crate and placed here. I'm not even sure if this is legal the way I'm doing this and selling off meat, but the store doesn't seem to mind, so I'm not going to worry about it too much. Uh, is that only 10 I put in there? No, okay, it's 12. I always double check to see if I screwed up in any of these. Uh, but there are 12. So it's pretty easy because I can smash them. But it looks like we're doing pretty good. I might not need all the crates, but they might need to go into crates. There's so many of them. I killed everybody. Those are just little itsy pitsy babies now. They're now they're becoming big adults. We definitely gonna have more meat with that. I will have to go and check the food situation in the morning to make sure that they're all fed. I did feed them, like I mentioned, so that's gonna be a little bit something to double check again. And again, it costs, it costs, and costs for everything in this game. I might have to wipe out the pig population in there and separate out all that, that I can because it's just ridiculous. This is way too much work. All right. Oh, God, I slipped on a tent. Couldn't find my way back home. Jeez, what heck of a morning. One heck of a night. That's all filled, by the way. Each one of these have 12 inside, which is not bad, right? I mean, it's it's, it's good. Tell me it's good, please. Tell me it's good. <laughs> I need someone to tell me it's okay. Everything will be all right. All right, uh, I need to try and get around to this side here. And there we go. Okay, so at first, okay, initially it kind of goes the opposite way for no apparent reason. There we go. So I'll put down a gate and uh, make our way across here and check out. We just have a couple more left to do. Doing pretty good. I mean, overall, this is this is a lot of meat. Uh, considering I thought we'd be able to fill up all of them, but, you know, it won't be a problem. <laughs> it won't be a problem. I'm not sure. We're going to have to wait for them to plump up a little bit more. I might have to go get myself a few more of these uh, coolers and stuff uh, just to capture all of them, too. Or we could just go and sell this off and see how much it is. I don't know. I, I, I have stuff to do still here. I need to make sure they have food before we have some kind of pork apocalypse. Uh, well, it's already happened. But <laughs> a lot of people in here. A lot of picky people. <laughs> oh, my God. That's right. I'm calling them piggy people. Can't help it. All right. We have all this fine stuff. We also have roosters and chickens on the other side. I have that one little piece of meat there. We're going to leave it there for now. It's That one's going to be tenderized by the rest. I have to go and check to see if they have food. Okay. Or there's any babies in these things. Okay. Pick up. Drop baby number one and two. Okay, that's, that's we're gonna have to get rid of some chickens here. Sorry, yeah, no, sorry, you can't come back out. Sorry, it's perfect. All right, grab you, and stop making you run around here. Oh my God, there's more poop for freak's sake! Did I get any more babies in this one? No, no. Okay, how many freaking eggs are in here? By the way, I don't even know. Okay, let's 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 go back to first person here because it's gonna get a little, little bit. Oh my God, yeah, they're almost out of food. They should be. Can I, can I get multiple feeders next to each other? Will that just constantly work? Or is that going to bunker it up? I'm not even sure anymore. Hey, everyone. How you doing? Oh, I'm doing okay. I had a rough night with a lot of pork issues. I don't know if you know the, the piggies next door. You guys might have heard a couple of like, well, shots and stuff being fired because at one point. I think that's a horse's. 
Uh, at one point, it got a little crazy out there. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, uh, our one rooster inside here seems to be doing a good job. I don't know if these, these babies might turn into a rooster or not. Then we're going to have a big issue. I think we might have to take out some of the chickens in here today. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to take out some chickens. Well, I mean, at, at the end of the day, as long as we get the most money for the pork, I don't care. Oh, you're so cute, though. If you guys stayed like that, I would never do anything to you. Honestly, after that, you all become like Colonel Sanders' uh, feast, man. That's what it is. I mean, I have so many freaking eggs and so much poop. If you guys didn't shoot that stuff out of your buttocks and not eat it in front of me, I think you're extra cute. Yeah, no, that just, that's just how it is, dude. All right. Yeah, he's just like coming up here and trying to sell. Oh, I can grab poop from a distance. From a distance, I could grab your feces. Here we go. How far can I grab that one? Oh. Oh. That rooster is pissing me off now. Okay, there we go. We do want to have another rooster issue. Now, rooster meat is a little bit uh, more money of it. Uh, sometimes you can get some good cash out of it. Uh, some people mentioned they actually uh, utilize that for frying, I think they said. That. I, I don't know. I, I've, I've never... I don't know if they sell that or a store. I've never checked it out. Never saw someone say, you want some rooster meat? All right. That's so many eggs. I think at this point, the graphics just gave up and became one massive egg. Maybe at the end of this, it's going to be one big, giant Easter egg. That's how they make them. That's how it is. All right, so we have rooster meat. We have chicken meat here. I guess I can bring some of this over to the other side. I don't think we're going to have any more rooster issues. Oh, I still have... Are these all full? Oh, my God. I still have all those, too. Okay, put that over here. I should have put a gate on this side. Jeez, that would make life a whole lot easier. That over there. <laughs> Told you guys, it's not like it's simple click and go. Now, I cut off a lot of, of work here. You guys know that, right? You guys and girls, you guys know it. Tell me the coffee feels. You know, say, you know, I, I, I see it. I see a game. I just... <laughs> oh, my God. No, it's not that many left in here. That is pretty good. Okay, I, I have to hop on. Sorry. I'll hop on the wheel, wheel. Wheel. Yeah, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Which always causes problems on the smaller one, by the way. Every time we try and grab all this stuff, it's a big pain in it. You know what? Uh, so there's going to be some chicken meat in there, too. I, I don't care at this point. Like I mentioned to you, the most important thing is for us to sell. Now, we won't be able to fit this trailer in there. I will have to unload all these suckers. The only thing is you can't unload them before. And let's say if I log out or something, log back in, and then all of a sudden the game doesn't realize those things are down. So, yeah, it becomes a little bit of a problem. Just a little bit. Uh, and this is obviously too wide to fit near the restaurant entrance there. They should have a big opening like a same thing that they have the store we could just draw and kind of drop off a uh, entire you know thing like this trailer full of, of goodies you know what i'm saying uh let's go see what the piggies are doing here i mean i'm gonna check out the cows how you guys doing oh i left the gate open all right you guys are not the right size just yet you haven't re oh you're you're kind of plumpy eh? hey plump master we have dead pigs already oh my god if i got a dead pig here um, I think there might have been something that went on between these two. And they've now... Oh, well, there we go. I popped you out. I hope that helped. I guess I'm going to go and get a crate. I should have brought a crate with me. Sometimes pigs just don't have enough food and they can't reach the uh, troughs and stuff. And some just hog <laughs> the food, as you know. They're kind of, uh, yeah, the saying. <laughs> but yeah, they kind of uh, hog the food and it becomes a big problem and such i don't know they people are mentioning they can have babies pretty darn early so this could turn out to be another pork apocalypse and have another spree of babies here again oh my god i tell you that's it's the poop factor that just kills me every single time every time i play this game it's the amount of poop this is where a ranch hen would be kind of good go over and kind of clean up all this crud that we have all over the ground i mean it's friggin' helpful i really like it like you know the gas station game we have those those people walking around and cleaning up i mean that just makes a lot more sense to me than having me having to do this work. I mean, I get, I, I'm really cheap, obviously, as a rancher. I don't want to spend any more coin I have to, but there's no way a rancher could do this all by himself. There's no way in heck, unless he's like a god or something. There's no way. Yeah, really, honestly, this is like, and this is probably like half of, or actually a quarter or one-tenth of a poop that real ranchers get to see every single day. Now, I can't imagine having to take care of that. These things are like poop factories, these things. They poop right in your face, too. You guys remember that, one of the episodes? Yeah, they actually pooped right in my face. It's um, it's good. Look at this. We have a whole bunch here. I, I I might wait for them to plump up a little bit more. I might wait for that. We'll see how much money we can pull out of this thing. All right. We, they have tons of food. They're in pretty good shape. We can close again in case of an emergency. Uh, something happens where they decide to try to leave this fine place. 
And uh, yeah, we're going to have to take care of some of these chickens here, unfortunately, because it becomes an issue. Now, I need to get myself... Oh, that's what I needed. I need to get myself another crate up here. Another cooler. Because we, we killed the pig in there. And that's not appropriate to leave that on the ground. I'm pretty sure most of them don't want to walk on top of their friend or eat their friend, possibly. Oh, for freak's sake, when you're small... Oh, oh! When you're small, it's so much easier to make... Oh, wow, that's a special taste that's going to be in that piece of meat. Um, yeah, enjoy. If you guys have to pick up your local supermarket um, and it has a little poop flavor, um, just think of that as extra seasoning. Like uh, steak spice or something, you know? That's pork spice. <laughs> I, I don't know what to do with this. There's too many of them. Oh, pork apocalypse on its way. All right. So how many are in here? 12. Wow. All right. That was a full 12 shot uh, with that one little piece of meat left over. That's good. So 11 on that one. So it wasn't the, a fully upgraded pork oplos. Oh my god, there's just so many things. <laughs> this is too many. Okay, yeah, we probably will need more crates. I, I'm thinking we're good we're gonna need more of that. That's gonna be insane. I'm gonna have to buy another trailer. Uh just gonna check out to see how the cows and stuff are doing. Been a while, I haven't checked them out. I don't think I've milked them either. Uh how's my horse doing? I'm the only one horse left, I'm sorry. Well, completely just snubbed me, did you? Look, dude, I, I'm sorry. It's been busy. Uh, you guys have water and stuff, right? Not much. Oh, oh, I just mounted the horse. Oh, my God. All right. Well, that was a whole different kind of mounting. <laughs> We're not talking about that. Do I need more roosters here? I don't think I do. I believe they all kind of went away. Slowly but surely into my containers. Okay, so let's grab this. We're gonna have to. Uh, we're gonna have to take care of this situation here. All right. What we got here is first person who walks out of here is the one that's gonna get killed. Thank you for the uh, two people who have volunteered for today. I uh, appreciate it. I'm gonna close this because I don't want you guys. To oh, you want? Wait, we have another. We have another victim. I mean, another another one coming out. Anybody else want to? Because I don't like to select you guys. You guys choose selection process by walking out of here you want to be part of this you've changed your mind ma'am okay that's good um but um this one's taking your place okay oh crap bad shot oh my god they run <laughs> just waste like eight bullets I'm joking oh my god yeah good choice coming out huh let's see if anybody picks to come out next time all right let's skin your ass let's skin you and skin your butt too. All right, we're good. How many pieces? That's only three chickens. I'm sorry, we're gonna have to grab a few more of you. Anybody else want to come out? I mean, nothing happened here. We just had a little bit of a Wild West kind of action. You two have not uh, any problems with this? Okay, that's good. Sorry, we're gonna have to close the door for a few seconds. Boop, boop. Anybody else like to come out? Not at the babies. No, no, you don't sacrifice your little ones. That's just sick, dude. I caught it before it dropped. Ooh. Oh, I need a few more. You. <laughs> you look like a victim. All right. Great. <laughs> That's right. A little picture for these guys to watch. This happens. Your future. Your future's so bright. I gotta wear shades. All right. One, two, three, four. That's good. That's five. Okay. We want to keep a couple. We want to keep a couple. Oh, that one just went around a corner really quick. Oh, shit. They're fast, little suckers. Oh, one second. Reload time. <laughs> oh, hey. Did you walk through that door? You just came back around the corner. Check in what's happening. Should have stuck in there, buddy. Oh my god. Nothing's going on. You guys are freaking out for no reason. You really are. I'm telling you. A stupid rain. I swear to god it hasn't stopped. Every time I'm logging out or do other things off camera, it was raining all the way through there. There's no way to stop yet. Who stopped the rain? I want a full stack here, so I need one more. One more. Oh, I have it. Okay, you guys are all good. No more killings for today. Okay. Okay, everybody's okay. Yeah, did you poop out a little eggy? It's okay. No need to poop it. 
It's all good. We'll put that into one of these mammoth baskets of eggs. Wow, all right. So that's thinned out the herd a little bit here. That, that, that coop is a little thinned out. It's kind of nice. Uh, so yeah, give them a little bit of room to walk around and not freak out. And that cow I thought was escaping. He is not. Thankfully enough, uh, the meat you guys can't reproduce, so therefore you can live and let die. That's right. And by the way, just as uh, in case you guys were wondered, that's before and that's after. That's how it ends up, buddy. No choice. Uh, some deer meat, too, all over this place. We should be picking those up, too, if we can. I mean, it would be kind of nice if we can fill up all the containers we possibly could. But like I said, the, the piggies are plumping, and I don't think we have any more I can utilize here. Oh my god, no, no, no! Oh, that was that what I wanted to do. Okay. There we go. No, they're really not big enough yet. They're just not that size. There's one maybe over there, but I think she's pregnant. That's the reason. Right down there, that plumper there. That plumpy one, I think it's because she's pregnant. So, look how they can eat right through the fence. They also could have, uh, you know what, between the fences too. So, we found that out the hard way. Look at the feces just right in front of me. Just popped it out, man. Just dropped it right in front of me, didn't you? No problems. No, just go and pick it all up, Game Edge. Don't care about me. All right, well... I think we might have to wait for the plump up a little bit more before we go and sell all this off. I might go and get myself a few more of these containers later on. Probably a good idea to uh, grab a couple of these and throw them through on the other side of the fence. Boy, this is really messed up, isn't it? Oh, screwed this up big time. Uh, but yeah, I think I might just grab a couple of these and put them through the fence so I can go and grab myself a few more of those. I really want to know how much I can make off a full killing. In other words, we might have to go pick up ourselves a couple more pigs. I might do a mass mass killing, uh, unfortunately, uh, for their lives. Uh, but, you know, just to be able to find out exactly what we can get from this. So off camera, I'll probably go back and do a whole bunch more and stack up another 100 plus in here. I don't think we're going to need that much, but we're going to do it anyways because we have the coin for it. You know what I'm saying? We got the coin for it. And then we'll have to uh, take some time before we can go and... Uh, and sell off everything. We could probably build our house next episode. A nice big house we want to build. The big house! Yeah, I kind of like to get it done. I have all the lumber. I worked my butt off and cut down a whole bunch in front of that deer there. That's just a whole bunch of work done there. So we're going to try and cut that down and get it all up you guys and girls. If you want to see how much we can make off of this, please, of course, get in the comment fields. Hit the like button. Tell me what you would like to see. And if you like to see a whole lot more of this, you know, I'll try to get as many episodes out as I can. And hopefully the content will continue flowing from the developers like I mentioned beforehand. I would like to see a, a little more uh, hard work placed into it. That's what I'm saying. Considering the amount of sales, you know, it's all good. So thank you all for being here. Really appreciate it. Again, you guys are absolutely stunning people for being here every single day. Hit the like button, being calm feels, and all your amazing support. Thank you to all the members out there who's taking time to do that. And the Patreon members too. Thank you for that. Really appreciate it. And everybody on Twitch, too. Everybody out there, everywhere, for being here every day. And saying like button, too. You guys are stunning. You guys are absolutely the best. This is Game Edge. It'll catch you guys on the flip side.